play. I love you and AD together. I think you make such a great match. But was there any red flags for you in the pods before you proposed? I mean, we see you kind of struggling a little bit when, you know, she was talking to Matthew and things like that. But there, were there any like really big red flags before you proposed that maybe you were like, oh, I don't know about this? I think I was once I got over the like, hey, I'm in the game and don't look at the physical aspect. I think I was bought into the process. Once uh, I got past day six, I think everything started relatively moving really smooth for me. And I was really hyped up for the proposal. Oh my gosh, Clay is a walking red flag. I mean, from the moment I met him, it was red flag, red flag. Uh, but I think initially when he wanted to know about like the physical and what I looked like, I think that was very telling and a huge red flag. Did you ever get a chance to meet Matthew? And what, if, if so, what was your impression? <laughs> Uh, Matthew and I had a few conversations post pods and you know, he apologized. He said his piece. I said mine and we moved on. Do you feel like you were um, understanding of Clay's insecurities as your relationship went on, you know, prior to the wedding? I did. Uh, when Clay opened up more about his past and all the things that he did, had been through, it kind of made sense why he was so guarded. And I think me taking things slow with him and giving him that safe space to be vulnerable really changed the game for our relationship.